my god! <laughs> okay, we're lining. And we've got a big water snake right behind me. Woo. Snake! No, oh, I'm not looking. <laughs> we'll probably best to wade right to down to there. Put in off the ripples and make our way down, but it's all out of water. Yeah. I think we're gonna wait this one, not run it. Chris from Novacraft, you be thanking me. Or, or maybe to the middle. Unless you think we can't go down that. I think the V is centered to the right a bit. Yeah, there's a rock down the middle. I have to go right to that rock. Right to that rock. So this way and this way. Rock! Woo! Look at that one! Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, no, no! Like no, not like that one! They sneak up on you, Andy! Woo! Well... I'm just gonna look out for rocks here. I think straight down here. Yeah. Okay. Rapid one of the day. Woo! I gotta find out what that bloom is that smells like perfume. There's different ones, like some are more acidic than others. So. Andy's just bailing out the canoe with a sponge because it needs it. But look at this river. This is uh, just after Sheridan Rapids.
Okay, so we've run a bunch of uh, small rapids, class ones, but there's not a lot of water. Just have enough to crunch down. But that last one, like it's, it's not marked as a portage or anything. There's two uh, drops to it. We had to line it, it took a long time to line it. If you don't know how to line a canoe or at least know to get out and wade, don't do this. <laughs> These rocks are really sharp. They're actually, uh, I don't know what kind they are, like, almost like a shell. No, they're not a shell. But yeah, they're not smooth and round. They're pointy. How you doing, Andy? Doing good. You ripped your pants. I ripped my pants. <laughs> they're really shipping your pants. Another fine mess. What time did we get away? Uh, before eight. Yeah, so it was already. It wasn't easy getting out of that bed this morning, though. <laughs> hey, what happened to your caterpillar, friend? Well, when you went out to find out uh, where we were at, I, I did a release. Oh, the wild release, did you? Yeah. I said goodbye, Dirk. Take care. <laughs> Have fun. And then when you came back, you stepped on. <laughs> Andy's talking about his friend he made yesterday. Dirk? Dirk? Dirk, Dirk Wiggler. Dirk Wiggler, the caterpillar, landed on his hat. And he had his hat on the hat for like two or three hours, didn't you? Oh, yeah. All the way across Dalhousie Lake. And <clears throat> they, uh, then uh, when we finish for the day, he released them into nature. <laughs> yeah. Go for it, Dirk. <laughs> Free! Free at last. Fly like a butterfly. <laughs> well, here we are in a very nice area uh, of the Mississippi River. It's downstream of Plays Fairville, after all the rapids. And it's just this meandering, meandering, uh, once again, uh, silver maple and red maple with a very wide area of the river and lots of sedge. Yeah. The and the uh, river just joined in. Oh, really? That's where we are? All right. Good thing he's got the map. This is where the Clyde's River joins the Mississippi. I paddle the Clyde's River. It's a nice river. Great. Um, and I'm just talking away on the camera while he's paddling. This is basically, you know. I, I, I tend to I do that. I don't get out much. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have paddled the Clyde River too. <laughs> you know, the really uh, ironic thing though is that we're I, we're loving the whole serenity of this area. Like, there's no cottages, no no nothing. It's just, you know, just really really ni nice paddling. We come around the the, the point, we like, we see one house. <laughs> it was a friggin' mansion in the middle of a swamp. And then the island we just went around is for sale. <laughs> if you want to buy the island. Anyway, have a look. Fantastic. It's lunchtime on the Mississippi River. <laughs> We're sitting in the middle of Swampy Island. Hey Andy. <laughs> we just went through Ferguson Falls. There's no falls there. It's a little swift. Nice nice buildings, nice old buildings. But I was told there was a public lunch there by someone. There isn't. So this is where we're having lunch. All right? And thank goodness I don't have to pee. Me too.
Camp, the campground, in Mississippi Lake. Awesome. Andy, what was that that comment you made earlier? Oh, when we saw a bird. Yeah, we saw we saw a turn. Our first turn. That means we're on the Mississippi Lake. That's right. And I said, well, this journey's had lots of twists so far. But that's our first turn. <laughs> well, we're here. <laughs> Andy, you had an incident today. <laughs> yeah, my pants ripped. Yeah. And then the sun came out. You didn't put any sunscreen on there. And you? Mr. Callan didn't didn't take care of me. Now I got a sunburn and I feel like a French fry. <laughs> so far, we 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 kept to the schedule, which to me I I probably should be shunned about. I way too many long days. Um, especially now too because there's not many places to legally camp right so we have to be really strategic and on, on our route choice because if we're in the bush we just you know just whatever in the bush right but yeah we'll, we'll figure it out we're good we we will persevere and um, and be creative if we have to Okay, time to take boots off. Oh, well, and uh, I gotta say, if you want to do a gear review, Keen saved the day on this trip for waiting. And I'm gonna put my Keen sandals on. So, yeah, it was a sunny day. A little, a little warm at one point, eh, Andy? Yeah. Uh, and, uh, and uh, we had the, the breeze a bit. We ran a lot of rapids, a lot of rapids. No, we did not run a lot of rapids. <laughs> well, we ran a lot of Swiss. So you tell, we're tired again. Very long day. It's just around five, we finished, we started around seven. Um, or before eight anyway. We don't know, we don't care anymore. And yeah, so we booked the site. This is on the west shore of Lake Miss Miss Mississippi. Wow, I need more water. And uh, yeah, we're here for the, the night. And a bit of a surprise tomorrow, we, we schemed up something. Just to shake things up. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> just to shake things up tomorrow. And we're being smart about something. I'll tell you, I'll tell you in the morning what's happening. It's day five. See, you know it's day five because you don't even know it's day five. We knew it was day one for sure. We knew good day two. Day three, uh, I'm not sure. Day four. Where are we? Where's this treehouse thing? 
day five, we don't care, right? We're just going down the river. Oh yeah, it's the big part of the day. Yeah, huge, huge. We didn't portage today. Not once. Well, I had a portage up to the campsite, but. Yeah, well, 30 odd clicks or whatever. Yeah, we did over 30 kilometers today. Uh, really long day. We had a current for a while. Yeah. Currently? Yeah, currently we had a current. In the, we did, um, oh, so Sheridan Rapids, yeah. So watch the footage of Sheridan Rapids. Um, and we did, we did a lot of swifts, but it was so bony. We, we, we lined and waited majority of the ones that you could run. And uh, you, we couldn't run them. They'd be bashing the boat up. And the boat already has got major scratches. Sorry, Chris, we're no craft. <laughs> it's a good boat, though. The tough stuff, awesome. Uh, I mean, I remember the one guy on the shore, he goes, hope you got a plastic boat. <laughs> and I said, no, no, I got tough stuff. And he looked at me like, I know what you're talking about. I'm blabbing. Uh, and Pat, you know what? The people, we didn't see too many people. Really, wait, we didn't see many boats. I mean, you see cottages and houses, and you know, there's what, what times where you just in this green oasis for a long, long time, meandering river, meandering river, and those are boom, this big house up the hill. But uh, majority of the time, that's not the case for today, anyway. There's a good section of the river, I love it. I would do it in the fall. Oh man, it would be beautiful in the fall. Um, the current is not too strong, so you could go up river and then down river and do it as a day trip. There's so many day trips on this, on this river that I'm learning. That, yeah, when I write this up, I'll, I'll write about all the possible day outings as opposed to do something what Andy and I are doing. <laughs> the whole river! Oh. <laughs> Okie dokie! Right. Awesome! There's strange people eyeing up Mr. Cowan and... Stop it. Okay. Stop it. We won't say what happened with that. Why? Yeah. Yep. Nice people saying, mm -hmm. oh, I love your gear. <laughs> Thanks. Yep. I think two ladies were eyeing us out because we're, we're rough. We're looking rough. Yeah. All right, what was the best part of your day? Um, the part where the water snake <gasps> snuck up on you. Oh, and God. I, I didn't need that at that time. <laughs> I was worried about falling into the river. And then you're like, yeah. Yeah, look behind you. <laughs> and it wasn't, it, it was It was like a cobra. It was like, Aah. I like the rapids. Uh, I, I thought, you know, it'd be good if there's a little bit more water. I, I, you know me, I'm like, I'm like, whoa, rapids. Um, you love, you love, I'm going to get you a t-shirt. I love rapids. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind doing them. I just, uh, yeah, I'm a very anxious person. So obviously going down a rapid with Mr. Comboy and I'm, I'm in the bow. Kevin, you just tell me where to go. Left, left, no, no, no right. <laughs> there was one point where you're like, I don't care, Kevin. Just like, <laughs> <laughs> For the last, what, four, four to five days, yeah. we've been paddling along. We had one decent weather day, but all the other days, rain. Sometimes lots of rain. And, and uh, to the point where, you know, Mr. Cowns, I was glad you said you were almost hypothermic because I, I thought it was just me that day. Ooh. And and I was cold, and if I like got another notch colder, I would be like, oh, we need to deal with this now. Yeah. And because um, you're like soaked through, still raining, a little bit of wind, even even though you've got some layers on. So anyway, we we survive. I was just hoping to out survive Mr. Callan so I could Thanks. toss his body overboard and get out of this mess but uh, <laughs> oh yeah when you told me to stay in the boat yeah and you got out yeah and then and I threw you downstream yeah. and then it was like I catapulted into the into water. the yeah into the the, the maws uh, maw oh, the gaping maw of death yes it was gaping <laughs> And wilderness setting tonight, beautiful. It, it was, yeah, it's lovely. You know, there's a birthday party over there. <laughs> the local wildlife is having a birthday party. Yes. Yeah. Happy birthday to you. Oh well.
Okay, signing off. We'll read later. Let's just put earplugs in and have a, have a drink. <laughs> <laughs> By the time the show has... That was thunder. That didn't come out of me? No. Okay. By the time the show has ended and the class photo has been taken, Kevin has had enough of being a princess. Look at that. He's storming out after the class photo. Not a happy Kevin.